Hi, welcome to Raju's Natural Science Academy for easy and happy learning. Good morning students. Today's topic is Stomata Observation Activity from the second lesson of 6th General Science Knowing About Plants. Already we know that there are 10 topics in this chapter. In the previous videos, we already learned first 7 topics. Today we are going to learn about 8th topic that is Stomata Observation Activity. Before going to observe stomata in leaf, first we have to know what are stomata. Let's know. Thousands of tiny pores are present on the upper and lower surfaces of the leaves are called stomata. Plants release excess water from their body through stomata in the form of vapor. This process is called transpiration. Gaseous exchange also occurs through stomata. So, stomata facilitate transpiration and gaseous exchange. What is the aim of today's activity? The aim is observing stomata in a leaf. For doing this activity, we need some materials such as beetle leaf, glass light, water and microscope. First we have to take a fleshy leaf. Here we take beetle leaf. Peel the outer layer of the leaf. Place it on a slide. Put a drop of water on it and observe under the microscope. Students, observe carefully. What do we see? These are the stomata. The bean shaped parts that you see in the leaf are called guard cells. The aperture in between the guard cells is called stomata. They act like our nose. They are useful in the exchange of gases between the plant and atmosphere. Students, are you ready to do the homework? Write the answers for the following questions. What is meant by stomata? What are the uses of stomata? Draw a neat label diagram of stomata by using your science textbook. Write the procedure followed by us for observing stomata in leaf. Ok students, study well, grow well, be a good citizen and be proud to be an Indian. Thank you.